7.50 on a bit of a gray Wednesday morning. Uh, welcome back to Breakfast Television. We love success stories. We love Quebec success stories here at Breakfast Television. Carmelo Marsala is a perfect example of this young entrepreneur making waves for something called SprayNet. Now, let's get to it, Carmelo. A lot of people will hear SprayNet and they'll think hairspray. That's, that's what we call it in Quebec. Not hairspray. Tell no. me what this is. Okay, well, uh, essentially what we do is we spray on paint. Uh, it's a permanent exterior paint solution. So uh, we can do aluminum siding, PVC siding, typically what people don't think of when they think of paint. Uh, Let's so look at some photos while you explain. Let's So uh, they'll think, okay, look, this is the before and after. Tell yeah. me what, ex what this does exactly to a home. So the, as you can see, the aluminum siding has changed color, the doors and windows have changed color. All that's done in one day. Uh, it's permanent, doesn't look repainted, and it's a fraction of the cost of replacement. So, so it, say we're looking at some more pictures here. Yeah. So say if you're looking to sell your home and you, you know, uh, first impressions are everything, yeah. this is a effective, cost-effective way to do it. Yeah, it increases curb appeal, and actually a lot of people do it too. Oh, wow, look at that, yeah. yeah. So how does one, how does a now, you were 27 just a little while ago, happy yeah. birthday, you just turned 28. Thank you. How does one even come up with something like this? I mean, this is, this yeah. is sort of changing the way people renovate their homes. Yeah, well, when I was 19, when I was uh, in university, I was doing a student painting job and a lot of people would ask me for the service and I didn't think it was possible so there had to be a way uh, every problem has a solution so so uh, I figured out how to do it and now we've been doing it for years we've done uh, close to three four thousand homes I'm not really sure the, the number wow. but, uh, and now we've really perfected the method and we actually have our own custom tailored products to be able to adapt to these situations so people will hear this at home and say okay well I can get my house painted what is so innovative about about the way you do it there's a specific tool specific mechanism that you, you can yeah well essentially with. what we've done is, is most people don't realize that when you buy a front door and it's black it's already been painted right uh, so what we do is we take that industrial paint that's done in a factory in a controlled environment and we take it outside so you're getting the exact same thing you'd get as new and so no maintenance uh, it will never peel uh, scratch resistance but essentially the same thing as new and so were you a paint expert I don't even understand no. <laughs> how this happens you went no. to business school and yeah. then you yeah. become a paint expert yeah well well I became a paint expert just just by uh, by my own independent research Th this service didn't really exist before uh, so because we're kind of creating it as we go, uh, we've been working with chemists, uh, we've been working with a lot of top people yeah, in this the field. Isn't, and this yeah. isn't just in your in a backyard, you were fiddling around with paint no. and figured it out. Yeah. <laughs> well, at first it was. Yes, initially, but now <laughs> yeah. it's, it's yeah. next yeah. level, if yeah, you Yeah, know. exactly. At first we were just testing new products, and now we're actually testing high-level products that haven't that aren't even commercially available. So, so and it's, it's going quite well, we should say. Ernst & Young has named you a finalist for the title of Young Entrepreneur of the Year. That's not too shabby. How does that feel? Feels a bit like an overstatement. <laughs> However, modesty, modesty but, here. Uh, I mean, it's cool. Uh, it's cool to get some sort of recognition and also mainly to get our name out there. Uh, most people don't know the service exists, so yeah. uh, that, that, that's uh, the coolest part. About you're, that. you're taking yeah. spring net away from the hairspray people exactly. and making it uh, your own. So what's next for you? Uh, well, we've uh, we've gone to Toronto. Uh, we, uh, we've started franchising in Toronto. We're all over the province of Quebec for 2015. So our franchise model has been great. Uh, no more territories available for 2015. Sorry wow. for Quebec. <laughs> uh, but that's cool for us. And uh, we're going to Toronto, Vancouver. We're going to probably hit up the rest of Canada. Well, listen, Carmelo, oh. Marcella continues success. Check it out. Yeah. It's called SprayNet. We love these success stories. And I, you just said there are no... No more franchises left. No, not 28 in Quebec. years old, and look, look, I, big accomplishments. Thank you so much for joining us. Thanks.